morning guys. Today we're going to do a little vlog style. I need to run some errands. I thought that I would take you guys along with me because I need to go to Walmart and pick up some beauty items. I also want to like take a little look at their jewelry but otherwise I really just need to get some like shower stuff and things for my bathroom so I wanted to take you guys with me. I also need to get my car washed and get some gas. Pretty random but let's go get those things checked off my list. They're playing music so loud, but like look how cute these are. Oh my gosh. Okay, look at these little swimsuit cover-ups. Okay, Walmart. All of the swimsuits look so adorable. Wait, what is this? Do they have my size? No. This is cute too. All right, got a couple of great things. I actually want to pop into Five Below real quick and see if they have the cloud mug. What is this? Oh my gosh, so cute. Alright, no cloud mug, but now I'm gonna go get my car washed. All right, got my car washed and now I'm just gonna fill it up with gas and then we're gonna do the haul. But I just learned about a new app, Upside, who's also sponsoring today's video. So thank you so much for sponsoring today's video. When I learned about this, my brain literally exploded, exploded because I had no idea such a thing existed in this world. And now I'm just mad I didn't know about it sooner. Upside is a free app in which you can get cash back on daily essentials like gas, groceries, and dining. And yes, it's real cash back. Real. It's not like a rewards thing or credits or building some type of point system. It's actual real cash that gets transferred to your bank account. There are over 100,000 gas stations, restaurants, grocery stores that are available on the Upside app. So when you download the app, which I'm gonna link in the description box below for you guys. Again, it's free, it's wonderful, it's where has this been all my life? So when you go to download it, make sure to enter the promo code Crafty Girl, which is gonna give you guys an extra 25 cents on every gallon on your first tank of gas. So when you download the app, don't forget, put in your Crafty Girl promo code so you get that wonderful cash back deal and then you're going to want to obviously set it to allow for your location and that way it's going to pull up wherever you are it's going to pull up the stores that are participating in giving that cash back so whenever you find the claim that you're looking for for your area whether again you're doing a dining or a gas station you go into the app you select your claim and then you pay as usual do your usual routine pay with your card and then you follow the steps in the app to get your cash back some of the top earners on upside earn up to three hundred dollars a month in cash back in real money that gets deposited back to your account also who wouldn't love right now to just get like your gas cheaper so if like the gas here is you know 319 if the claim is available for that gas station through upside it could be like 277 per gallon like uh, wh why 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 am i just now finding out about this and there are a ton of gas stations when just talking about gas alone not even dining but like gas alone there are a ton of participating gas stations 7-eleven philip 66 valero uh, Loves, Chevron, Exxon, Mobile, Circle K, the list goes on. 
And then with dining, you've got big hitters like Chipotle, Papa John's, Dairy Queen, Wendy's, Taco Bell, and the list also goes on there as well. So don't forget to download the app. It's in the description box below with the link to go straight to the download and use the promo code CRAFTYGIRL to get 25 cents on every gallon in your first tank of gas. Thank you so much to Upside for sponsoring today's video. I'm going to go ahead and pump my gas and get my cash back on that and then we'll get into the haul. All right, back home from running my errands. I also went to Dollar Tree, but you guys didn't see that in the shop with me in this video. I actually filmed a TikTok instead. So if you don't follow my TikTok, it's at Crafty Girl TikToks. Um, and, but I will show you guys what I picked up from there. So I went in, like you saw, to five below. I did not find the cloud mug. It's probably past the point of finding it, I think. I'm not sure if it's even still like on their online website. Also, I walked in there and you can get your ears pierced now at five below. That seems new. So anyways, um, my goal for going into Walmart was to just get some like, you know, bath beauty stuff. And I definitely got the goods. I spent $58.25 total. I needed to restock on this shampoo. Now I'm not really like, lately I've been a Dove person, um, but this is like a new shampoo. This is my second purchase of this, I guess. I've really liked um, my first purchase that it's now an empty. So this is the Dove Daily Moisture one though. So I follow a TikToker and she has gorgeous, beautiful hair. And this is the shampoo she uses. So I was like, hmm, guess I'm gonna use it too now. So I just needed to restock that. And then I needed to just like go all in in my vanilla. Um, another heavily TikTok influence, but also like I've just been a vanilla girl from beginning to end. And this is like my fourth or fifth one of these. This is Tree Hut in vanilla Shea Sugar Scrub. Love this, smells so amazing. But um, basically what I'm trying to say is even though I've always been on like my vanilla products, I started watching someone who kind of like talks about different vanillas and like how to pair things together. So it's been a little eye-opening for me. And then I saw Tree Hut put this foaming gel wash out. This definitely seems new and, or at least to me, I haven't seen this before. This is a hydrating oil complex and it is in vanilla. So I thought this would be such a beautiful combination in the shower. Um, because I saw it, I decided to get it. This is the Body Cology Sun Kissed Lemon. They also had like the body wash, they had the lotion. Um, I actually put it in my cart and then I was like, mm, but how often am I gonna reach for those two products? Probably not that much considering I am more of a vanilla junkie. So this one is just so good. Like, look at that. It does smell like lemons. There's, I feel like there's like a hint of floral in this though, um, which I'm not so much a floral person, but you know, but it is an exfoliating scrub and I'm trying to do a lot more exfoliating with my body. Then I just needed to restock my native in coconut and vanilla. This is my favorite. And if you didn't watch my Dollar Tree haul, this was the item that I was talking about, kind of hoping that maybe we'll end up seeing something like this at Dollar Tree eventually, but this is the Dove Shea Butter and Vanilla Body Wash. So I just found the Shea Butter, actually, I think I got it from, I got another, yeah, this is from Dollar Tree. So the girl that I watch, she pairs this together in the shower. She does the bar soap first, and the bar soap is just Shea Butter. I don't know, is it vanilla? No, it is vanilla too. I was gonna say like that, those are vanilla beans, but um, this is vanilla as well. And then she then does the body wash after. So I'm very excited to try this combination just to see what that smells like. And the last thing that I got was this Maybelline lip liner. Now I'm not a lip liner girl, but I'm starting to think maybe I need to like come back to it a little bit and try it out. 
Um, maybe my lipsticks will stay a little bit longer. And I'm trying to find a dupe to the Pillow Talk. Is it Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk? I don't know, this kind of looked similar to that color. I don't know if it is a dupe or not because I don't actually own the original, but it's just a purely nude color. So I thought that one would just be great for the tones. Okay, so that's it from Walmart. I did look at their rings and jewelry. Didn't I wasn't really feeling anything. I even looked at their clothing. Eh. Um, all right, but now let's get into the Dollar Tree haul. I've been looking for these little mesh bags. There's actually more of these, but I could only find it in the purple. And they are so cute. It's by Sassy and Chic. The zipper. So good. So this is my fourth one now. And I haven't even like emptied. Like I'm just, I'm obsessed now because I discovered that this is a straight dupe to the Sol de Janeiro. Like there's just no, which by the way is vanilla. It's like a vanilla and caramel thing. And it actually says it on here, notes of pistachio and salted caramel. The caramel To me that also kind of gives like this tone of vanilla um, cause it's just like so warm and like, just smells like a bakery. Um, this is insane to find that Dollar Tree, like, ah! Um, so there's that. And then in my last haul, I talked about how I was going to get another one of these if I found it. This is the Personal Care Line. Um, it is a leave-in hair conditioner. Um, and this is supposed to be compared to Sun Bum. And it's good. It's good. Um, then I picked up these cute little stamps. I was just like, I. it's so funny because I feel like I've been complaining about Dollar Tree not putting out new stamps. But now all of a sudden I'm seeing like new stuff coming in a lot then we've got this um be pure has put out a super cute set if you go watch my tiktok you'll see like they have like a mommy and me um like um what do you call those headbands that you put on when you like do your makeup or whatever those like shower headbands but um in this whole line with this like floral and pink and blue i hauled the scalp massager they have so much in this line this would be a great time to go secure some of these things for like Mother's Day. But here's a little makeup brush set. It's perfect for travel too. So found those. Then I recently cleaned out my makeup brushes. I, however, use a technique that I saw years and years and years ago that painters do when they clean their brushes. So I use the same method with my own makeup brushes. And basically it's like a little bit of oil, like olive oil, and Dawn dish soap, and then you swirl it in the palm of your hand um, to kind of clean it, which has always worked for me, but <clears throat> I don't want to put Dawn dish soap on my hand. So I got this makeup brush cleaning mitt and I got it in black because I love black, so I thought that was so chic. Okay, then I picked up some movies, which I actually feel like I did good. Take me home tonight. Yes, I still buy movies. I still have a DVD player. So $1.25. And then a Blu-ray. They have Blu-ray at Dollar Tree. Um, and let me tell you, this comes in handy when your Wi-Fi goes out. Okay. And then this one really shocked me. This is the Dance Academy, the comeback. I I don't think I've ever seen this. Now I watched the Dance Academy like seasons. They ended it pretty short. I was so sad because this was actually such a good show. This was huge in Australia because this is like where it takes place. I also got another one of these little mini powder puffs. They came back in stock and I'm definitely going to use them for like those like small little corners of my eyes. Then I got this one also. Um, just because I was realizing like, because I'm going back to my natural nails, they are getting some like dirt under them, especially since I've been changing Loki's food as well. So I'm like dealing with different things with my hands with his food. And I just need a brush to like really clean under there because no matter how hard I try to like, you know, it just doesn't get that clean. So excuse my nails if you see them dirty, I'm sorry. 
Um, okay, then I did pick up some stickers. I got these. So cute. At Dollar Tree, I spent $30 even. And everything was $1.25. Okay, then I picked up the this facial sponge. I've hauled it before. And I just need to do some really good exfoliating. Like, there's tiny little bumps from, like, things, you know, blemishes, like, under my skin. And that's because I'm not exfoliating. So... I need to do that. Then I found the cutest claw clip. Brace yourself. Is it a strawberry? Is it a peach? I feel like it's a, it's a strawberry to me. It's a strawberry to me, but oh my gosh, that's absolutely darling. Makes me wonder what else they have because this is a Dollar Tree brand. All right, next up. The the, wor the person working there was literally putting these out. And I waited patiently and I scooped them all up by Sassy and Chic. And they are a powder puff with a case. Why? Why, are, why is it that like I just love the most adorable little things? And the powder puff is the color of the case. So they're not just like a plant. Well, I mean, this one's pink and the case is purple. But... I guess these two are the same powder puff colors in those two, but how freaking cute. See what I mean? Fours. Dollar Tree does things in fours most of the time. And ending this on the sweetest little bath sponge note you'll ever see. I feel, I just feel like a lot of you are going to be just, look at this. A lemon. The lemon gets me. Gorgeous, would be so cute for a gift basket. Makes me wanna do a gift basket just off of this lemon alone. Then we have an avocado. I thought the avocado was weird because it's got like a face, whereas the other ones don't. I feel like they shouldn't have done a face. You know what I mean? Um, and then the strawberry. And this is only three. Is there a fourth? Comment, let me know if you know what it is. Is it a cute watermelon? Is it a grape? I want to see more grape stuff. Who remembers when Dollar Tree... This will tell me how long you guys have been shopping at Dollar Tree. Who remembers when Dollar Tree put out those list pads? Those like grocery list pads, but they were in the shape of fruits. And I was obsessed with the grape one. I still have it somewhere in my craft room. I bet I'll find it. But that's it. That is my shop with me. Thank you for running these errands with me today. Went to Walmart, Five Below, stopped at Dollar Tree, got my car washed, got gas. Thank you to Upside for sponsoring today's video. When I tell you I called everybody, I called everybody I know. And I was like, yeah, you, you have to be on this. Micah's gonna be on it, okay? Uh, I'll tell you that much. Also, they have over 500,000 reviews like amazing reviews because i can totally see why upside thank you once again for sponsoring today's video don't forget to go into the link in my description box below and i'm gonna pin it in the comments as well take you to go download the app again it's free real cash back that goes back into your bank account um so don't forget to use the promo code crafty girl when you set up through the app and then just start start getting that money that money back from gas stations and dining and, and all the fun things. So that's it for today's video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.